Guidance. Students should be familiar with the names of these polyatomic ions. Well, let's look at the derivation of the word. Poly means many. For example, polydactyly. That's if you've got uh, extra fingers. Polytheism. That's if you believe in multiple gods. For example, the devil, Medusa, and the flying spaghetti monster. Are the ones I believe in. A polyorchid. Well, that's if you have more than the regulation two to I've censored that one there. So poly means many. So let me write out the ones you need to know according to the syllabus. So OH- minus is the hydroxide ion, NO3- minus the nitrate ion, followed by the hydrogen carbonate ion, the carbonate ion, the sulfate ion, spelt the British way, phosphate ion, and finally the only positive one you need to know is the ammonium ion, for SL at least. So let's uh, try and bring these a little bit more alive. Hydroxide ions, well, that's a terrible thing. Uh, if you were to accidentally drink that, you're not encouraged to vomit it up afterwards. And the reason why is if you, if you drink it or if you eat it, it will burn your esophagus on the way down and cause it to constrict. And then if you vomit it up again, well, it will burn your esophagus on the way up and cause it to constrict even more, potentially choking you to death. And the nitrate iron, well, that causes blue baby syndrome. I encourage you to look it up on the internet. And when you see the babies aren't as blue as you'd hoped, that probably means you're a bad person for wanting the babies to be bluer.